hello everyone welcome back today recipe we are going to learn how to make cocoa butter from scratch and this is updated video because i have an old video this one i'm giving you a better explanation So we are going to use only two ingredients, dry cocoa beans and water. You add your cocoa beans to a skillet on a medium heat and you roast it because when you roast it, it's going to help the oil to come. Like when we cook it, we can see the oil better. So after 20 minutes, you up the heat. After 20 minutes, you up the heat then we are going to remove the skin from the cocoa beans so you can see remove all the skin from the cocoa beans it takes time but it's worth it yeah so this is how the beans look like so you let it cool completely let it cool down and after i remove it this is how much beans that i have got you are going to blend these beans that the cocoa beans in a food processor or any kind of blender that you have you can blend it to get a powder form and your house is going to smell like chocolate so now we have our cocoa powder you are going to boil hot water so you add your cocoa powder into the boiling water on a medium heat stir the mixture together and let it cook we are going to cook this mixture for two to three hours so after two to three hours you are going to see that the water will reduce the water is going to reduce so keep stirring so that you don't burn your butter so you keep stirring so you stir it every five minutes the oil will start to settle on top so you can see tiny tiny oil on top so now you can see the oil is floating on top so keep cooking it so after you see the oil on top you collect all the oil into a saucepan so you keep collecting it so this is very easy to make i think my old video i didn't explain it better for some people so they keep asking questions about it that's why i have decided to make a new video to talk about it or explain it better so after you have collected all the oil you cook the oil again the one you have collected you cook it again so that all the water in it will dry you let it cool down you strain the cocoa butter using a cheap cloth so that we can remove all the particles but still i couldn't so i have to strain it for the second time to remove the particles again so you can see I didn't got much cocoa butter that's one thing if you want much cocoa butter you need to use a lot of cocoa beans that's why cocoa butter is very expensive than share butter so you pour into a silicone mold and you allow it to cool down when it's cool it will become very hard then you pop it out from the mold so this is what I got you can store it in a container at a cool dry place and cocoa butter can easily last for five years please check out my second youtube channel at queen mother diy tv and subscribe time for watching this video don't forget to subscribe like my video share my video and leave me a comment bye bye let's go